All right, well. We're gonna do more Risk of Rain 2. It's been a while, um, but the new DLC is here. I'm probably very rusty. Um, it should be installed. We'll see. Okay, it looks like it is. Wait. No. That looks like the blue item. I wonder if they've changed it. To be honest, I have... Okay. It looks similar, but not quite the same thing. Alright, so yeah, we are on the DLC. Cool. Uh, other than the new characters, I don't really know much about it. Okay, one, one of them is unlocked. So that's good. Okay. This one looked cool. It was like a monk sort of looking character. Um. Okay. Let's keep some of this stuff in mind. I've been looking forward to this, so... Wait, why is the... Hold on. Give me a sec. Oh, what the hell? No, 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 no. I was wondering why it looked so weird. Okay, there we go. That's better. Okay, we're good. Bizarre. Alright, we're good now. Okay, shift is that. Uh, okay. I guess it's a heal. Oh, okay. <laughs> Interesting. Alright, I'm just testing out the new stuff. Think about like what would be best for this. It seems to me like it's probably going to benefit from crit and crowbar by the looks of it. It feels very artificial like. Okay, that does damage as well. That's not bad. Wait, it, oh, it sacrifices your health? Whoa, okay. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know if I like that as a skill. I guess regen is kind of key. Okay, interesting. I wonder if there's an alternate version of that skill. Not the greatest of starts. Doesn't look like there's anything you can do while you're in meditation state. I'm curious if it does anything else. So I guess just stay out of 
As long as you don't wind it up a lot, it's fine. Okay, so I can use it to engage like that. I guess just don't overdo it. Let me see if this does anything. I'm not sure how I feel about this character yet. Okay. Oh, it has like, I just noticed it has this diagram or something on the right. I wonder what that means. I should have probably read some of the abilities. I see what it is now. Like a set of directions you need to do. Interesting. Curious what that does to the character, like getting that off. Now I know how this works. Hmm. I mean, I don't think I'll pick up any items yet. 
Let's just see. Strides would be probably a good pickup, but I think I'm gonna bypass it. Is there a new stage here? No. Um, I can't tell if that's new. Hey, Nick, what's up? How's it going? Played one game yesterday, it was pretty good to be back. What do you think of the new character? I'm only just starting to mess around with it now. It's interesting. I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. It's only the first 10 minutes or so. The highest potential is for multiplayer. But yeah, it makes sense. But, um, I mean, it seems to me like crit would probably work. I haven't quite figured out yet how it works. I only just worked out that it wants you to do like a mini <laughs> rhythm game thing. I'm not quite sure why. It's one of those things that it's fine now, but I imagine in the heat of combat, I probably won't like it. We'll see. I forgot that there's chests. It's been so long, like, the fact that there's chests here. Of course I got brass contraptions. That's just my luck. I hear you, where are you? There you are. Yeah, the thing that I'm not sure of is the um the movement skill like draining your health. Um okay, new item, what is it? Chance to reflect incoming damage. That would be really good on loader. Like, with Razor Wire. And Tincture, that'd be pretty cool. Alright, so we know what this is. Do you know what the indicator in the bottom right means? Like, does that mean just stacks, and the more stacks you have, the better it is for you? Like, you should just be doing this whenever you get a chance. Um, I'll probably go movement speed, to be honest. And we'll go opal. Yeah, this is the part that I think is going to get me killed, is just the fact that it, it burns you. And you got to be quick. Uh, yeah, yeah, tanky enemies, yeah. More tanky enemies. <laughs> uh, watch them get crowbar or something. Like, pretty lucky that they got slug. I haven't read patch notes either. If they've done balance changes to items, but for now, I'll just play it blind.
Okay, max stacks. Glad they reverted the timer in the void. Yeah, that was... It was so dumb. Um, it just gave you no incentive to come here unless you were trying to complete the alternate path because it just wasn't worth it anymore. Ooh, syringe. Okay. It's kind of a damper, like that you do that in the void. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna do that one more time quickly. Alright, good enough. Uh, uh. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I knew that we were going to get something annoying. Alright, well, you know, I, again, when I play this game, I'm of the mindset as if, if you can't win this, you're not going to win anyway. So it's just... Is it just me or is it uh, less enemies spawning? Usually it's pretty chaotic by this point. I'm actually glad I got um, the opal. That's probably gonna let me get through this. Like it's just um, interesting. Backup mag would probably be decent. Yeah, I feel like it's not spawning as many enemies. I don't know. I might be imagining it. It's been a while. Like you, am I just going to get every tanky enemy in the game? Ah, welcome back. I sure miss this. Okay, this is kind of cool. Back A backup mag build would be kind of fun. Multi-fist. It stuns as well, so that's kind of nice. I kind of like it. Alright. Sweet. Um, I'm going for the new item. Secondary skill uses primary skills next shot damage. Okay. Secondary skill use, uses primary skills next shot damage. Just saying it again. Secondary skill deals primary skills first shot damage or next shot damage so if you have a weak secondary and a strong primary I'm just trying to think where it would be useful I can't think of a, a primary skill that's super strong or maybe I'm interpreting it wrong all right, we'll see. I'll think about it more. Maybe I read it incorrectly. Maybe it adds it on top of the damage, which would make more sense. I don't think it would replace it. I'm not sure, I read it really quickly. I'll check it out in the logbook afterwards. Um, but that seems like an interesting interaction. Oh, you can check it in the tab menu? Alright, I'll do so at the next Void Seed. Or Death. 
Whatever comes first. They just had to get tough at times. Alright, I'm doing well. Um, I'll go Bandolier. Okay, give me a sec. Yeah, I mean, I read it pretty quickly, so it's possible that I'm wrong. Whoops. Oh, good, it lets you make mistakes. That's good. Um, that, okay, yeah, you can. Secondary skill use increases... Oh, it's the other way around. Secondary skill... Increases primary skill shot damage. Okay. Yeah, I, I bricked it. I read it completely wrong. No, you are correct. Um, which, it's, it's only the next shot. So it wouldn't be useful on loader because it's like, okay, you get one punch. You get one punch. So it's not a loader item. It, it's useful for this character, for sure. Um, it's not really useful for any of the melee characters. Multi might benefit from this. Oh, you know what? Huntress might, too. Throw a glaive and then her, her next shot is pretty strong. We were both wrong, it's fine. <laughs> the sum of our incorrectness um, forms a correct statement. Or something like that, I don't know. Yeah, Railgunner, true. I think Multi might be able to get some use out of it, because Multi has that um, harpoon shot that does quite a bit of damage. Might work with Acrid. Yeah, but Acrid's is like a melee move, isn't it? The problem, I think, with the melee characters is that they just get one melee attack boosted. Which, I can't imagine it does much. It's worth testing. But, I mean, if it works on Acrid, it would work on Loader. I'm getting this again. This definitely seems like a good item. Oh yeah, hey, Impulse. Okay, oh, good. Wait, what is this? New Chronic Expansion. Uh-oh. Gain damage after killing enemies in quick succession. Ooh. Okay. Um, that would, that would go really well with Huntress, like, doing a, um... A glaive build with her. Okay. What? I don't... I don't know... I don't know what those are. Whether I should be worried. Item stores experience... Okay, cool. Alright, that's fine. I don't have to worry about that. Um, there are three new characters from what I can see. I'm not sure about... If there's any hidden ones, but um, in the menu, there's three. Uh oh, wrong button. There's always the possibility that they have a character that's just hidden and has like some secret method to get it. I haven't read the patch notes either, so I'm not sure if they've rebalanced things or what items they've introduced. I just know this character and um, another character. I won't say who, as to not spoil it, but yeah. Because they were in um, the announcement. I 
Okay, this is a good spot to fight the finale. Uh, should I be worried? I think I'm okay. They don't really have anything that revolves around RNG, and it doesn't affect um, tougher times. Had it been anything else, yeah. That would have sucked. But also, just thankfully, we got this this one here. Because they do take a while to get here. And you have pretty good cover here. I didn't check if they have new game modes or anything like that, or if they changed the clips. I mean, so far I like this character. Oh, no. Nice. Alright. Give me a new red. Nope. Um, no brainer. It has to be this. I got ATG, so that's, that's pretty decent. Okay. Let's just clear the map out. Um, there was an attack speed printer, but probably not worth going in on unless I find a scrapper. I'm curious if repulsion plate mitigates the damage of um, that you take when you use your movement skill. Slug is probably a very... Ooh, ooh, okay. We've already got a GG build. I've got ATG Clover and, and this. Okay. Now I just need the equipment and the, I'm, I'm laughing. Well. This is a nice welcome back. Was there any other ones I missed? Hold on. Down there, equipment. Give me rocket launcher. That's... That's decent. I don't mind that. It has its uses. Um... That's a dangerous thing to have. But, you know, I'll grab it. I probably won't be able to hang on to it, if I'm being honest. Uh, oh, another equipment barrel. This is probably more useful because... Let's just see what effect it has. Okay, it does ramp up, but it, it does make it a little more usable and less risky. Because then at least... Yeah, I can do that. So, that's fine. Um, I just want to make sure I got the most out of the stage. There's no rush. The time has stopped, so... Just take our time. Oh, yep. Here we go. Nice. I think that's it. I think I got everything. Yeah, I should probably read how that... Like, what it means... I have three stacks of it. I need to read what... How the stacks work. Because there's, there's multiple indicators that I'm not sure what they mean. Okay, this is a new item. Um, on hit, enemies are knocked into the air. What? Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Can you imagine that on Loader? Can I play a chef after this run? Uh, I can't chat member because I haven't... 
uh, unlock chef yet. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching over on YouTube. This is my first run in the DLC, so I haven't met the requirements yet. Whatever they might be. <sighs> I was kind of hoping for a new stage, but... This is what happened the previous update. I had to, like, roll for the new stage. So hopefully there's less of that this time around. Okay, we got Golden Boy. Um, that's a new item. I'll check it out. How much do I need? Oh, I already got enough. I don't know why I didn't highlight. Um, deal extra damage at lower health. That, I reckon, is probably garbage tier. Unless... Unless you have Transcendence. That's probably the only reason to use it. If, like... It classifies Transcendence with 1 HP as low health. That would probably be it. I mean, I'm not seeing the enemies get knocked up. You just seen you survive. Can I explain what the abilities are? Um, I'm still getting the hang of them, but, you know, this one, it's effectively just a piercing blast. You have a fist that goes up and stuns. Uh, and then you have this, which is a heal, um, but you have to do like a little rhythm minigame. And then it has a travel skill, which it does damage, but then over time you take damage, so you can't channel it for too long. But it does do damage on impact. And then as you play this rhythm game, like you get stacks, which you see in the bottom right corner there. Um... I haven't really figured out what the stacks do. I'll probably read it, because I don't think it's something that's obvious. But I imagine it improves either the healing that it does, or um, gives you a, a little bit more damage. I like this fist. This fist is cool. Like, backup mag with this character would be a lot of fun. What is going on? Why are they moving? Um, I don't know if I should bother with the plates. I usually try to find them, but... Alright, let's just go to the other side. Um, I do... Oh, you know what? I do want to do this. How much? Okay. It's so much easier in multiplayer. I'll have a look at uh, what's required to unlock Chef. So I do want to play a Chef. Like, I've been waiting for Chef to be in this game. But I figured I'd jump into it blind first and just kind of get used to it again because it's been a while. Item stores experience and gives stats on item removal. So this is an item that you probably want to scrap eventually, so if you get it early and then scrap it later, it seems good, but I don't know, like, how useful is experience really? Oh, that, wait a minute, I think I remember them doing it. They were saying you just gotta collect ingredients, and then Chef unlocks. So anything that's, like, considered um, a food ingredient. So slug, steak, um, anything that- oh, the fruit? Okay. No, now- now that I read that, I'm like, oh wait, I know how to unlock Chef, I just forgot about it. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Um... Let me go in on this. Is 
Is that enough? I think it was like 650, no? Gotta get back to work, but you'll be lurking. Yeah, cool. Well, thanks a lot, dude. Yeah, I mean, I'm not sure. Like, I haven't found experience to be that useful other than in the early game, where, of course, it, it means you survive a bit better. But later on, I, I feel like it's irrelevant, which I kind of question the item's value. But we'll see. Um, I'll get plate, because I want to see if it reduces... Okay, plate does seem to um, allow you to stay in that form longer. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, I think it's one of those things that's good for early game, but then... I don't know, man. Like, it, it makes it very, very niche, which I guess it's not an uncommon thing in this game. There are items where you'll only ever grab them under a specific circumstance. We'll see. All right, I think we're good. Let's just go in on it now. Oh, okay. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, this character does seem to do a lot of damage. It feels like a better Artificer, and that's kind of weird to say, but that's the impression I'm getting from it right now. It's like a better Artificer, but then it has a support skill to heal the team. I'll be curious how much it does when I do multiplayer. Bandolier was definitely a good choice, yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> the multi fist is awesome. I just need more backup mags. Alright, come on, game. Give me a new stage. Uh, after Golden Boy, of course. Um, I'll have a quick look for the plates. You'd be curious on increase options. Yeah. Okay, so one plate's here. I mean, I got the feeling like a crowbar build with this fist would be kind of insane. Like a ranged loader, almost. Alright, let's just quickly go look around the back. I gotta be careful not to blow up the pots. And then we can kind of see, like, if it procs the rings. Ah, that's unlucky. Okay, um, unless I can get it in the other spot, it's not going to happen. Um, we'll just get Goat Hill for now. I just want to move around quicker. I'll try, but... Is there one? Nah, it's downhill. Probably not worth the effort. Okay. So far, so good. Wait, what is that? Interesting. Oh, right. They, they showed these. Whoa, okay. On death, no, no.
Yeah, I mean, my ATG procs are carrying. That's the thing. Like... <laughs> Kind of afraid to find out how much damage that does. Does that ability give your buff other than half? Um, I'm not sure. It, I think it does, but I'll need to read it. Because there's definitely stacks of it. I imagine it's just increasing how much it heals. I didn't read any of the, the skill tool tips. I kind of just dove into it. I probably should have. But I wasn't aware that there was going to be like a secondary mechanic here. I'll find out. There's definitely something going on but I will use this where possible. Okay, nice. Another thing for Clover to pull up proc. I suppose I'd keep an eye out for Brenner's having the stake. I'll probably forget. <laughs> if there's a, a stake printer, scream at me. Quite a bit of damage, even the prime. Oh, but you know what? That's right. I got that item where primary shot gets buffed by using secondary. So let's see. That's it on its own. And then if I do that. Okay. So it almost doubles the damage. Yeah, that's going to be sick on certain characters. I got all the chests, right? Do they cost? Yeah, I think we're good. Ah, move me. I want to see some new bosses, but it just hasn't happened yet. Oh, I should be looking for the lockbox as well. Is that it? Hang on. Yep, that's it. Alright, go. Yeah, just <laughs> hope we get a DLC level. We're at the mercy of RNG here. It's just unfortunate I haven't seen one yet. Okay, we're good. 
Um, I can't remember if the lockbox spawns in this level or not. I'll have a quick look, but I don't think it does. I think I probably would have run into it by now. It's only because here it's not timed, so... I don't have to go too out of my way to look for it. I'll just do one lap. If I can't find it, it's fine. Let's just keep going. Wait, there's two portals. What is this? Green portal. Alright, this is new. Gold portal lets you out, right? Green. This is definitely new. I'm not imagining it, right? There's never been two portals here. It was gold to get out. I'm going through the green portal. If it's gonna be a mistake, let's see. Alright. New stage. This looks cool. Finally. <laughs> something new. Like very prehistoric looking. I don't like that everything is flying. Ah, too slow. Hmm. Just thinking about that. I don't really have too much stuff that's on death. Okay, new item. What is this? Splits incoming damage. Splits incoming damage. What, between party members? Like, what are we talking about here? Or does it give you two damage instances instead of one? I guess we'll find out. Oh, you know what? No. We should do this. That's the reason why to take this. Just that alone, if I get more gasoline cans, it's going to be strong. Okay, no meat. Go mystery. Wait, is this all just... There's no lower area by the looks of it. Uh oh. <laughs> I panicked because I usually play on soon. And um, that's death. Alright, so that's what this is. 50% damage and then the rest is treated as damage over time, apparently. Okay. That's... Kinda cool, because if you heal... It'd be useful as a counter against, like, the brass contraptions. I'm 
just anything that's heavy hitting. It would probably be a hard requirement if you're looping. It might actually fix that problem that characters like Loda have where you just get one shot for being a melee character later. Okay, new item. Oh, no, wait, it's the same thing. Right, right. I haven't kept track of what I've gotten. You'd be curious if the reflect and armor options decrease the dot ticks. Yeah. Because usually play is very good against dot ticks, with the exception of, like, the revised void where it ignores it. I mean, it definitely works for this. I can't imagine why it wouldn't work. Um... I think I can probably start the boss and get enough money. I wonder if I should be looking for artifact things in the stage itself. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Come on, man. When are they gonna fix this thing? <laughs> I mean, it didn't go off the edge, but that was very close. Drives me nuts. Alright. Just go. A green portal again. Interesting. I bet green portal is probably like the alternate path. So, you know, I have a very uh, strong build here. blue portal as well, like getting shell would be good. But I don't want to risk straying from the green portal path yet. I haven't seen a scrapper yet to be able to get rid of the XP beads. Okay, let me go have a look. Ooh, what is that? Waiting for it. Chance to increase item rarity at Shrine of Chance. Ooh, okay. I always get those shrines, so... Uh, let me see if there's another chest that's probably not worthwhile. There's a lockbox somewhere in the stage as well that I haven't found. 
There it is. Okay. Alright, I think we're good. Alright, green portal. Gotta say, I'm surprised at how well this is going for a first run. Whoa, this looks cool. Neat. Oh, okay. I mean... That's the hill I think it is. I mean, the stage designs in this game are, are always on point. Uh-oh. Okay. Ooh, ooh, what is this? Um, let's be... Quick. <laughs> Go away, Gop. Oh my god. Okay. Not good. <laughs> yeah, I probably shouldn't bother with this and um, just get on with it. <laughs> Ah, the watch is broke. What the heck? This is what I mean. Is like stopping now to do the heal move. It's. I don't think I can pull it off. Yeah. Well, I was wondering when it would start getting unfair. Dude. Okay. This is like that blue item that just nukes everything. Jeez. I'm not even sure where I'm going. Okay, this has got to be like a path. I mean, I would imagine if I collide with it in the air, it hits me as well. Ugh. I'll tell you, that opal pickup, like, was the right call. Fine, fine, just, just heal. What is this? Crack the geode? Oh. oh. Okay. That's interesting. Wish I would have known that. I hope it's not important. Okay, it's stopped now. Okay. Well, this is definitely giving me, like, you know, right before Mithrix vibes. I don't really have anything I can trade at the moment. Like, I think I'm good with my build. There was no scrapper anywhere, so... I bet if I go down, um gonna start the hellfire again. Oh, I got a bad feeling about this.
Okay. Well, oh. Yep. This is gonna be fun. Um. That. 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 Was that worth it? Dude, this ATG thing might carry me. Okay. <laughs> go. Whatever this is, go. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, okay. Oh, hello. Okay. Um, da, 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 da. Are you kidding? It's not over. No skills. Oh, this is super. Ah! <laughs> My skills got disabled. Ugh, okay. Given that was the first time I came across that thing, I think I did pretty well. <sighs> okay, so let's find out what this is exactly. Once a condition is met, the skill revives one or two dead survivors. Or one or more dead survivors. Once a condition is met, the skill grants all living survivors a blessing that heals upon reaching low health. Yeah, so that's probably what those stacks mean. Um, when it's glowing, and you've done that spell enough times, that means you can resurrect a teammate, which... Cool. Um... And then gain plus one percent to all stats for each instance, so it does buff your damage. So you should be using that as often as possible. Okay. Um. So that's just straight up beat the final boss, and then this one, the walks recipe and the reform altar, which I know what that is. Is just collect every food item. Um. Let's just see if there's anything else that's new. Okay, so there's another skin for Railgunner. There's new skins. Looks like every character's got a new skin. Yep. What's the requirement? Oh, to beat Meridian. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, give me a sec. Just curious as well. Okay, no. <laughs> it's just... I guess I have three new characters to kind of go through this process. Um, but it doesn't look like there's anything new here. Um... How am I doing here? Alright, so there's still stuff to find. It looks like there's no new yellow item, which is interesting. One new blue. Several new reds. Apparently no new... Equipment, which is odd. Okay. That's a little disappointing. Okay. I'm good. I'll keep going with this character. Oh, okay. New stage, cool. I got lucky and rolled a new stage. This looks cool. I guess 
the problem I'm gonna have with this character is straight up this, doing this in the heat of battle. At least it lets you make a mistake, though. I'm happy it has that leniency. Try not to spawn anything but six new stages and when looping is the stages may have night modes. Yeah, I did know about the looping change. Like, I have been following the DLC a little bit. I question this. This item will be good if it works with Transcendence. I guess it depends what it classifies low health as, and I imagine that threshold gets better as you have more of those items. Okay. I'm, I'm having problems. Let me just... I, I should be doing this more. I gotta get into the habit of doing this whenever it's off cooldown. Oh, there's the child again. I need to find the altar. I bet it's it's around one of these back areas. Just a hunch. Yep, there we go. Okay. This new boss and new path is definitely harder. Just... I died because I wasn't aware of what it was going to do to me, so... I got caught off guard. I should have figured there was going to be something. Uh, what have we got? I'll go slug. Was that a glitch, or was it not showing the color? Was it not showing the color of the item anymore? Like, it's not high. Maybe... Alright, there's another one over there. Let's see. 
That's an interesting change. Oh, I don't like this change. You can't you can't go off color anymore. I guess it, it makes it higher skill to get a red item, but uh, I'm not a fan of that change. Like why? It's not like they guarantee you a red or anything. Yeah, not a fan of that. All right, we leave this. <laughs> ah, man. All right, let's go. Down, da, 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 da. Okay. I do like how evasive this character can be. Okay, so I assume when it's like that, that means I've met the requirements to resurrect an ally. But I bet it only happens when you use the skill again. Ow, 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 ow! <laughs> Ugh, I have to play the rhythm game character. No, I'm okay with this. It's giving me money. That's fine. I'll, I'll be okay. Oops. <laughs> um, it's probably not worth going for the gamble. By the time I get there and get back, let's just go. I want to get Transcendence to stress test that lantern item. Uh, no, I don't really have anything here. Okay. Yeah, I think Repulsion Plate is, is almost a hard requirement on this character. It, it drains a lot of health if you don't have one. Oh, there you go. You can see it. So, it's like... It looks like it's going to be below 50%. Yeah, okay. That's... Alright, that's decent. I thought it was going to be something way less than that. So, yeah, I wonder what the interaction is with the items that reduce your health pool. We'll see. Oh yeah, right, do this. You know what, between rounds I should just, like, get to max stacks. That's probably a good idea. And then at least I'm dealing more damage. I think they need a buff Artificer. Because this just feels like a better Artificer. Like, the left click is pretty similar and its right click is... 
with something strong as well. On low health, explode and teleport a short distance. Um, what was this one again? Yeah, that one. That one's all right. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Over there. Okay, let me get to full stacks. <laughs> Bear with me. If you've seen me play this game before... Sitting around in the void fields, waiting for something to happen, is a common occurrence. Oh, it's ready. Um, da, 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 da. I'll just get it to... yeah. Just need to do it two more times. Meantime, we can admire this character's design. Looks pretty cool. It almost looks like, um... Oh, what's, what's the name of that game? The weird Kojima game. Where, like, you're, deliver, you're effectively delivering... I don't know, it just kind of reminds me of that a little. Alright, that should be enough. Um, that's not good. Ooh, that's kind of an annoying one for them to get. to go beyond that. Um, I've already got one piece of meat. Let's go shield. I'm gonna be living dangerously here. Okay. So that's two food ingredients. I need the fruit and... No, I got slug. I just need fruit, right? What other item is a food item? Oh, no. Alright, let's... <laughs> Why do I always get these guys? for this. Yep, that's useful. 
Oh, it's over there. I'll do my best. I wonder why before it had a number on it. Um, plate. As much as I should have taken crowbar, plate's probably gonna work out for me better. Um, opal. Uh I have the worst luck in the void when it comes to enemies. After this run, I'll have a look at what's required to unlock the alternate versions of skills. Uh, this. I'm not going to pick that up. Until we're done. Okay. Got lucky. That does nothing for them. What was that? Oh crap. I saw like this weird red pixel particle. I'm not sure I caused it. Um, Razor Wire. Okay, that's fine. These won't be a pain. Mm -hmm. 
I'll try to ignore them because they'll take up a spawn slot. Ooh. curious about this. Uh oh. No, it's fine. Oh, please get there before the potion thing. Okay, it's fine. Again, got lucky. The greens do nothing. Wait, what? That procs it? Okay. Do I have anything? I don't have crit. Huh. So that means fist definitely. Yep, that's cool. I'm surprised a normal shot makes it go off. Okay, that's a cool combo. Ah, oh, I missed. Um... This one. Oh, what is that? What is that? What is that? Upon large or elite monster kill, chance to drop items. Okay. Okay. That's fine. We're fine. That does nothing. Um, I'll have to keep that one in mind. What does it look like? It looks like a... like a shell. I got really lucky with the items I got. I'll be fine. Yeah, I mean, I feel like I kind of have to, like, this could carry. It's not going to be useful now, but... If I get the right thing, it's, it's strong. Um, I'll go crowbar. I don't like what they did to the rain jacket. They just nerfed it into the ground. Um, what do I have? Don't have anything that works with this yet, so let's just leave it. I wonder if the buckler reduces the damage of like the fire ability. Let's see. And doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, 
chest over that. I think that's it. I was worried that I, uh, it's okay. I couldn't move for a second. I, I, I was worried my glitch passive may have gone off. So far the DLC enemies haven't been bad. What I mean is like, I remember when the first DLC got launched and I don't know, it felt like every enemy that they they created was just annoying. <laughs> I mean the void seeds were busted and just running into them meant death and so far I haven't seen anything too egregious. Like it seems to be okay. What was this again? Right, that thing. So I guess if you have enough regen, it's probably a really good item. I won't bother with the gambling. I don't remember. I think that's going to be the toughest thing is just remembering to do that. But otherwise, yeah, I'm not dealing the maximum damage I can deal. I don't like what this one might do, like I... When you get to low health, explode and teleport. So it's gonna teleport you to a random spot, but... I can definitely see a scenario where like that thing is gonna teleport you off the edge or something. Nice! There we go. Alright. That's what we want. ICBM is now useful. Oh, hold on. Oh, and...
just need clover. <laughs> I'm really bad at aiming that fist sometimes. Alright, I'm just gonna start it. to the beetle god. I got the gambling thing at the back corner. Alright, so if I'm not wrong, I just need to find the fruit. Oh, wait. That would have to be the fruit because it can't be the egg. It can't be volcanic egg because you can't have both at the same time. There's probably one other thing that counts as a food item. I got potion. Maybe. Because, like, you could say that you could argue that's your beverage for the meal. Remembering. Oh crap, it's a void seed. Oh yeah, we don't want that. Oh, 
What is that? I've seen those around. I'm not sure exactly what they do. thing. Please don't infest my beetle. Okay, two more. Where are they? Ah. <laughs> I was hoping for the fruit. I wonder if I just spam the direction buttons if I can get it to go off, like not even think about it. Because it doesn't punish you for getting it incorrect. Let me try. <laughs> I mean, okay, it works. Uh, it, it's, it doesn't give you that much of a benefit to do it that way. Damn it, it's on the other side. I think it actually might punish you by reducing the time left. I'm kind of disappointed by this. I thought that would be more noticeable. Is this thing just trying to get to... I'm just going to run through this that. Go away. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll get that pulled. No, this has got to be a bug. What is this? No, it's got to be a bug. Okay, maybe they haven't changed. Yeah. Because there's no reason that shouldn't be highlighting. Alright, it looks like it's just a bug. Alright, good. Ooh, ho, 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 ho
All righty then. I'm ready to get disgusting. There's no reason I shouldn't swap everything to this. Uh-oh. Uh, maybe I should hurry up. That might be a good idea. Not done. Fifteen ATGs, let's go. When taking damage, chance to trigger enemy de active enemy debuff supplies bleed. Okay. Alright, let's go. This is just a one shot. Uh, that's disappointing. But I'll do it. ATG prox. <laughs> um, I'm not going to keep this because I don't have gasoline. As a seeker, hit three or more enemies with single use of the spirit. Okay, I got the alternate ability. as much. Please be ATG. Oh, yeah, it's just that. to get another <laughs> another one yeah what does it mean when it has the number two next to it I haven't figured that out yet This just needs equipment, and then I'm laughing. Or Clover, either. Probably work well with Shrimp, actually, as well. Yeah, 
just a stage. But I guess it gives a chance for a red item. What have we got? Um, that's just free, may as well. Whoa, what are these? They're pretty tanky. Come up, you bastard. I'm not sure what this means, like, when they're like that. <laughs> okay. Um... Yeah. I mean, all I need is just for the ATG to go off once and then it's dead. It's dead. Oh, didn't hit it. There we go. Wait, did they change Beetle God? I got two of them. Oh, it doesn't make it stronger anymore. I didn't even notice that. How much? 5,000. Oh. Done. Uh, yeah, that's fine. More chances for ATG. Yeah, this is bugged. I must have done something, but the highlighting isn't working anymore. Maybe a reboot might fix it. It was fine before. this. Get the stack of Gorags. Didn't you just do this? I, yeah, I thought you did. <laughs> I don't know, Twitch um, has been in a habit of showing you stuff that you've already dismissed. I think I've been told that, hey, did you know that there's a new collaboration feature? Like at least 30 times. Despite me clicking, yes, I know Twitch, thank you. 
If you want to start the collaboration feature, just click this button that you, that you can't really truly opt out of, just sort of make semi-private. But thank you, confirming. <laughs> Your pet peeve are intrusive update notifications that are step by step. Oh, so you you must really love Windows then, huh? Windows 11 must be your favorite thing. I had to reinstall Windows because, like, my computer was bricking it and I was really afraid that, you know, the processor was dead, but it thankfully wasn't the case. But I had to create a bootable USB to reinstall Windows 11. And, of course, I couldn't do it on this computer because I couldn't even get into Windows to do so. So I turned on my old computer to do it, and then that thing popped up that's like, Hey, we noticed you're not using Microsoft Edge as your default browser. Let's finish setting up your computer. Would you like to use Microsoft Office, OneDrive, Game Pass? All that stuff that you said no to three months ago, but we're asking you again? I was, I was really angry. <laughs> Because I, I just wanted to make my my bootable drive and get off of that computer. And it took like five minutes of my time. Congrats on Microsoft making bloatware. I mean, it's always been kind of bloated, but now it's just super adversarial to the point where it's like almost spyware it's like and i'm gonna show my age here but you know in the early 2000s and mid 2010s where things came with sponsor toolbars and um virtual assistants that just spammed you with stuff except now your operating system is doing that You know, the thing is, Edge used to be fine, right? Like, when the new Edge first launched, it was pretty lightweight. There was none of that stuff going on. But now, it's just like, man. If you're not using Bing as your search engine, it reminds you. If um, It automatically opts you into, like, Microsoft Shopping, another service. It automatically, you know, sets um, the landing page to something that's just full of weather and news and all that crap. It tries to push their co-pilot thing as well. I don't know. I just hope that um, SteamOS really gets to the point where it's like, you know, usable. It's getting there with compatibility. But I guess the other thing for me is uh, capture cards just suck on... Or at least the experience sucks on other operating systems. Yeah. Kinda. Did what I could. Alright, let's get out of here. I've probably hung around too long. I got an ROG Ally X, so... Whenever they do the new release of SteamOS, I'll probably look at installing it on that thing. But I've been really enjoying using it. Um, this new item's cool. I like this one. Oh, good work. I may have overstayed my welcome. I 
everything is fine. Oh, it's just a healing drone. Oh! <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. It's like, what is that? I'm not used to that thing yet. B one sec. Just wanna see if there's anything else I can get. I have almost every item to unlock the new character. I'm just missing the fruit, if I'm not wrong. I saw someone was working on a mod to bring back the Windows 7 taskbar into Windows 11, and I'm keeping an eye open for that because I would love that. But just, I, I don't know, I just don't like the new taskbar and start menu. This might be me showing my age like, oh, new thing. Old man yells at Cloud, but... Man, by default, that thing is showing you recommendations and ads instead of the stuff that you actually have on your computer, and it just drives me nuts. You don't mind the taskbar? I mean, I think visually it's fine. I think functionally it's just... It's bad until you change a lot of settings, and even then, I don't know. I kind of like how it was before. See, when I used to say customizing Windows, it would be like changing the visual look of it. But nowadays, it's like disabling options that Microsoft has on by default that just annoy people. Doing your best to, like, have some agency over <laughs> what they're doing with their operating system. I don't know if this was a good idea, but I think this is what you need to finish to lead to the new path. But we'll see. If I die, I die. It's fine. I was reading today that, um... More on that thing... Where... Apparently there was going to be a new Crash Bandicoot crossover with Spyro, but then it got cancelled, and the idea for it sounds so cool. But I guess because... Uh, 4 didn't meet the somewhat unrealistic sales goals that they set for it, like they thought it was going to be like a massive nostalgia hit and sell way more than what it did. It's not that it sold badly, it's just... Yeah, unrealistic. You're excited for the new Mario & Luigi game? Same here. 
When is that coming out again? I know there's something Nintendo related coming out next month. I forgot what it is. Oh, it's the Zelda game. It's the Zelda game, Zelda game. Like, actual Zelda game. Which now I'll check out. I hope it runs smoother than Link's Awakening, but it won't. I don't think it will. And it's going to have that blur filter that just drove me insane in Link's Awakening. Actually, I gotta I got remember to do this. That's the thing that spoilt it for me, was that blur filter they had in the background. It made it feel like my eyes were being strained. Link's Awakening gave you motion sickness. Oh, because of the frame rates? I'll tell you what, like, the Switch frame rates have been so much more noticeable f now. Um, now that I've gotten, you know, a handheld that can actually do 60 frames a second, 1080p, and handle it perfectly fine. Um, man, the Switch just feels so old now. Alright, I think we're good to go. But, you know, Nintendo's trying to squeeze as much life as they can out of that thing. I think the reason they're doing that is because they're probably somewhat afraid of how well the new thing's gonna sell. Because this time around they don't have the novelty of the form factor anymore, and there's a lot of competition in that space. So, unless it has some new thing, and it's not just like a hardware bump, then I get the feeling like it it could potentially be, um, I wouldn't say a flop, but a flop in the context of how well the Switch did. Well, I mean, I think they haven't completely revealed their hand, like... Metroid Prime is going to be a cross-release, so... Have I gotten everything? Oh, I may have bricked this. Yeah, I should have been attacking. Sorry, I just need one proc. Give me one ATG proc! Oh wow, okay, I've got an ATG proc, but I didn't kill it. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. No, it's immune again. <laughs> hey, Laura, I forgot how good the soundtrack is. Yeah, this is one of my favorite game soundtracks. The new tracks are pretty good too. It's definitely going to be backwards compatible. Oh, no doubt, like... It's all but confirmed at this point. It, it just makes sense, because it's like a failsafe. If they get a similar situation with, like, the Wii U, where... The third-party support just became bad for it because it wasn't selling good, at least... Games on the Switch will still run on it. I think the main problem they're going to have is now they don't have the novelty of the form factor anymore. There's just so much competition in that space. Like, I can't imagine what they're going to release is going to be better than what I have currently as a, you know, PC handheld. It'll be cheaper, but it's not going to be better. 
The green portal didn't open this time. Okay. Alright. Ah, oh, no. Okay, I still got one bottle. Ugh, I'm probably not going to win. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe I should just loop. Oh, I know how I can do this. I can do art of, Artifact of Command and then I can... I can pick... Um, the equipment to be the fruit and then hopefully it'll unlock the new character. Remember to do that. I mean, for me, because, you know, I like Nintendo games, it'll probably mean I'll, I'll get the console regardless, but I guess it just depends what the launch lineup is. But it's definitely going to be a case this time around that the games I purchase will purely be their games and anything else I'm just getting on Steam. Because I can play on the handheld I have now. And it's cheaper because Steam sales. I have power, but... Uh, the problem is that power is like a... F a random rocket. This may be a way to change my fortunes. Um... I probably shouldn't do that. As good as that is, I... It... Oh! <laughs> Stupid asteroid. Um... It probably won't count for the chef unlock. I'm going to assume it, it won't count. What is that? Topaz Bridge Printer. I may as well try looping because they've changed looping as well, so we'll probably get to see new stuff anyway. At this point, I should probably just go for the teleporter. I wouldn't be surprised if they reduce the rate at which you get that fruit item. Because it seemed like it was pretty common before. Maybe it's just confirmation bias here.
Um, I forgot if I need to set the relic before or after the tally. I think it's before. I don't know. I'll go do it. Um, I guess go slow. Oh, what is that? That's new? Whoa! I heard something. First chest bought yields more than one reward, usable once per stage. Interesting. Um, I would ima- I would imagine it's inactive currently because I've already bought a chest. I'm gonna go get the artifact thing going. Fruit. Oh, no kidding. No, it actually. Okay. I mean, that was probably for the best anyway, because I do want to try and get the fruit. Um, but I'm going to do this. Because then that'll guarantee it. Um, I just need a sec chat. I need a... It's been a long time. I've forgotten what, what it is. Um, artifact of command code. Ah, here they are. Um, where is it? Okay, yep, that's six squares and three triangles. Got it. One, two, three. One. I remember it being like six, three, but I couldn't remember what it was. All right, now we go back. Since this isn't fatal... Whoa, hey. What was that pushback? Oh, 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 what it, why, why am I taking so much damage? <laughs> what happened there? Okay, I'm fine. Oh, you know what? I bet a mushroom probably shot me or something. Ah, oh, no. No, no. I know what it was. I took a heavy hit, and then that new item split the uh, the damage I was taking. It was like a, a burn. Okay, that's good to know. Matter. We're not going through that portal. I just want to make sure I got everything. Oops. Do 
Do I, okay, I still have the potion. As long as I still have the chef ingredients. straight too far. I did. <laughs> Whoops. It should have been from here. Pretty neat. So I, I should be using this on the big chest where possible. Is there a big chest? Hey, this is way different. They've changed it. This is way more intricate. It's not flat anymore. Okay, well, a time like the present. It doesn't yeet you into the air either. Uh oh. Nice. Well done. best place to hang out. Oh, there it is. Hey, no! <laughs> oh no, it does eat you. Never mind. So somehow I dodged the... Uh-oh. Cool. Hey, I mean, what's up? Mm. I didn't see it in an equipment barrel. I'm supposed to get the fruit, but I haven't seen one. Or a big chest for that matter. Um, probably this is the best one to open. Okay, cool, I got a choice. Ugh. Game, please. Ah, dick. Okay, I'll get it at the end.
I suppose that also lets me look at what else visually looks like a food item. Where's the yellow? There it is. Jeez. Okay, what, what's not helping me here is, like, I'm getting temporary speed boosts randomly. Because <laughs> I'm killing stuff, and then it causes me to walk off the edge. Stop. Where'd it, where'd it go, where'd it go, where'd it go, where'd it go? There it is. Okay. stand here. I can't believe there's no equipment barrel on here. It's almost like the game knew that I was trying to unlock the new character. There we go. Okay, we're good. Wait, that's not it? That's usually just three. The random speed up is, is just making me walk off edges. Oh! Wait, is it regenerating health? Oh, ugh, that's annoying. I hope that's not the case. Where is it? Just give me the item. Let this end. Just really unlucky. There, ah, thank you. Okay. Ugh, that took a while. Okay, um, so that. Is there anything else that's food? Um, you could probably argue coffee is food. Let's just get that, just in case. And then everything else, I think I'm free to do whatever I want. Um, 
I mean... Probably just stacking syringes isn't a bad idea, because I'm... I can probably get the ATGs going more. Yeah, again, it sucks that there wasn't an equipment barrel. I would have been able to unlock the character. Don't go over the edge. Okay, good. <laughs> Definitely way harder to navigate. Hmm, don't see anything else. I think we're done. I guess if I'm that desperate to unlock it, I can just start a run with Artifact Command on. Right, the nighttime stages. Here we go. This looks cool. Very cool. Um, this is good for ICBM. Forgetting. Trying to find a big chest or an equipment barrel. Just to use the star thing on. It's 
What's that? What is that? That's a... Okay, I have ICBM. But if there's a scrapper, I will give up knife. To find out what that is. It's a new item. But as it stands, like a 50-50 chance I lose the thing that's my damage output, which... I uh, don't really want to risk that. Alright, I think I'm just gonna go to the teleporter and then just look afterwards. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, that was lucky. Nice. Wait, Halcyon Shrine? What the heck is a Halcyon Shrine? Equipment barrel. Come on, fruit. No, no fruit. What is this? Uh... Oh! Uh-oh. What is this doing? It's doing something. It seems to have a tether to me. I'm not sure what this is doing. <laughs> Pray again. Um, it seems to be summoning enemies. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, so that's gonna lead to, um... The new boss, which... Like... I kind of don't want to do on this run. I'm going to see if I can unlock Chef. Like, I have the setup for it. I just, I just need the equipment. And then I have it. Didn't see a scrapper anywhere, that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, 
Yeah, doesn't look like there is one. I'm sure it'll pop up again. Would have been nice to find out what that new item was, but... It's too much of a gamble. Unless I find a scrapper in like the next 15 seconds, I give up. Okay. Wait, was that? Is that an equipment barrel? No. I'm seeing things. Alright, onwards. There's an equipment barrel. Scrapper. Bad. Don't let him latch, don't let him latch! Shit. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> Eesh. I guess the trash shop doesn't count as chest. Alright, again, going for the equipment barrel roll. Come on. No. Um, doll would be worth it. Because I have... I have knives. Might even go on. Hang on. Where's the altar? Speed up. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna try and get sh uh, the shell. Oh, yeah, okay, medkit. so bad at that. Ooh, okay. It's all good, it's all good. Did they rework? I'm noticing this new blue aura. 
I'm not sure what that is. At a certain point, I have to succeed with the equipment. <laughs> oh. Okay, back in a sec. Just gonna do a quick lap. I think I got most of it. Um, yeah, I'll just stick to normal. Looks like I did get it all. Oh, that's interesting. I think it spreads out the damage with me doing this as well. See if we can get a shell out of this. What is that? That's... Hmm. That's definitely new, but... The problem with these items is, like... There's a good chance it might brick what I have. You know? Nah, I'm not... Okay, one more. Alright, not worth doing again. I'll come back. As curious as I am to find out what that is, there are items that just straight up ruin your run that are blue. And so, probably not the time right now. I know, coward, blah, 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 blah. I need to find an equipment barrel. Possible. I'd be happy with the fruit or the rocket launcher. But I mean, doll's good still. 
Okay, that is good. Keep forgetting again. I got tired of waiting. <laughs> Just open that. It's fine. It's not here either. That means it's on it's on the hill. Uh, that's Tesla coil. I'm fine without that. What is that? I think I'm fine with slow. It really doesn't want me to unlock the new character. I'm getting more of these. <laughs> it's kind of fun to shoot multiple fists like that. More fists! Does this feel different? Hmm. No, it's still there. Okay. Okay. Well, let's hope it's there this time. Probably should have just fallen off the edge. But I didn't want to risk um, losing the potion. Oh. 
no. I think, it, no, it didn't proc the potion. Oh my god, I got lucky. <laughs> I almost lost it. Oh crap, it's still alive. Okay. What is that over that? As if worse comes to us, I can just do the artifact of command again and get that potion back. All right. No shell. I'll spend one. Tonic. One more. Game hates me. All right. I give up. Oh boy. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Okay, you can't you can avoid damage, it seems, by doing that. Oh, that is that is scary. I don't know if it died. No, it did, it did not. Uh, but I guess they're kind of attacking one another. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, don't... Okay, get in there. Throw it. Move. I'm asking for trouble. I don't think it died. Can't open a chest until I find either an equipment barrel 
or a big chest. One more egg. That is a big chest. Take it. Uh, what is that? What was that green aura? Oh, they're healing it. Oh boy. Oh, it looks like, yep, the thing is dead anyway. Die. Okay. What did it drop? That's a good drop. What's that? Where did the thing die? Here it is. Let's go. I just... okay. That's four. I'm also at the point where it's gonna give me a free red item. If I go visit, um... The thing. What is that? Less, uh, cell. Uh, probably not good with this. I'm hoping for shrimp. That's why I'm still opening these. It's just not giving me either item to kind of take this to the next level. Okay, um, go da 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 and go. Nah. Unlucky. I did get a Luna coin though. I think I, I need to go. This is gonna be something. Ooh, okay. Oh god. Okay, everything's fine. <laughs> oh 
I brought this upon myself. <laughs> My fault. Got the M Ooh, MP3 calls are kind of dangerous. But I guess if you're going to Mythrix, they're only dangerous. Ah! Bastard. Alright, I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to replace that. One more lap. I mean, that was gonna happen at a certain point. Nah, I'm good. What? <laughs> Classic. No worries, just clip through the floor, it's fine. Alright. Build is up and running. I could probably go challenge the new boss now. Now I don't need to worry about the shrimp. Like, this is effectively giving me that. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna go set up the artifact. Backed right away. This time it gives me an equipment barrel. <laughs> okay, I'll open this and see how it goes. There we go. Alright, we got damage now. I think I've seen almost every piece of equipment. Except the one that I really, really want, just to unlock this character. Like, it's, it's messing with me. And just watch, like, after I unlock the character, then I'll, I'll just see it every run. Okay, new item, what is it? On chance, on hit chance for a stunning boomerang. That's cool. I don't think we'll see it. Oh, I, I got... Alright, that's it. That's like a free red item if I go to the... Blue. Don't you dare! Got a potion back. Alright, sick. Now all I need is the fruit. Okay, so let's hit this. Uh-oh. 
Where am I going? Oh, you can see the boomerangs. There you go. They're like blue. Trying to get <laughs> continually using that skill. Whoops. Okay, we're done. It's quickly gonna go collect. I don't get it this time around, I'm gonna be so sad. Or if I die. I'm surprised it hasn't given me the weapon, the equipment try shop. Again, the moment I unlock Chef, just watch all that stuff appear all of a sudden. seen every piece of equipment I think now. What equipment haven't I seen? Except the fruit. Um, get this. Don't need to check the these anymore. Okay, well this is just free, so... Oh, nice. Alright, even better. I got five of these for free. I have a build to beat this new boss, I think. Um... Okay, I think that's everything. Please, please let there be an equipment barrel here. 
Because then it's done. What time is it? That's only mine. That's fine. Yes! Okay. We have one. Um, let me see what other before we start. Oh, you know what? So I'm not trying to do this like mid fight. I'm gonna just open up with this. Is there a big chest anywhere? There is. Okay, cool. All right, well, I'll do one more and then I'll start her up. That's enough for that. the fruit. Give me the fruit. That's the fruit. Okay, so then what do I do now? That's every food item, no? Or am I, I might be missing one with green. Let's see. What could be classified as fruit with green? Oh, maybe that? No, this. This. Still nothing. I'll, I'll figure it out. Or maybe I need to go to a specific stage. That's the other thing. I'll look into it. But I should have the components required. Just get what else is there? Um, that could be interpreted as food. There's another equipment barrel as well, just in case it's the lava egg. Is it that? Okay, give me a sec. This isn't a secret. Um, I don't want to watch a video to find out. Bison State Cautious Slug Infusion. Okay. Infusion? Why infusion?
Look for a new shrine called the Calcium Shrine. Okay. Right into it. Yep. Go through the green portal. Then there's a reformed altar. Okay. Well, then I guess I can stick with this. Alright, then I'm set up for it. I guess I confused it with, with one, because one's um, unlock method was getting all the food items. <laughs> I went to all that effort. It wasn't even required. Um, it's fine. Oops. Oh, look at all the look at all the equipment barrels now. Okay, I'm gonna stock up on these so then it just obliterates the map. I just noticed that this is the original layout as well. I guess they got different variants of it now. Which I'm all for. Keeps it fresh. Alright, well I guess the only thing left to do now is just, um... Get to the green area. I'm gonna find a Halcyon altar. Which I imagine are more common in loops. Wait, is that it over there? Yeah, cool. Alright. Sweet. Already got it. That's easy. These are free. Ooh, no. That is scary. Is that all of them? That's all of them. All right, cool. Let me just have a look around the stage. <laughs> Alright. That's probably really good for the fist. Hey, what where, where are the items? Oh, they all fell in one spot. Alright, I'm hitting this again. Um, I'm just gonna go collect the rest of the items real quick. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> I may as well fight the boss. It gives me another item.
can see a printer somewhere up the top of that. Ooh, die. Um, okay, I know what that is. gamble it all away. Okay, um... Receive blessings? Oh! That's cool. I guess I didn't see that last time. Alright. Do not mess this up, it's somewhere. Just find it sooner rather than later. <laughs> or maybe it should. Uh. I didn't look up the specific location for this. Oh, that might be it there. Yes! Alright, let's go! <laughs> Unlocked! Okay. Finally. Okay, next run, absolutely playing as chef. Alright, I'm just hitting it now. Oh god, what is this? This is scary. I just took this, just because it's closest. Void effect. <laughs> I hate it. Ugh. No, you don't. Oh, it's another one of these. Cool.
Fuck off. It's <laughs> alive. That's kind of funny. Brother chests. I mean, that doesn't count. Um, we'll go stun. I'll probably do a reboot of the game just to see if it fixes the whole thing where the item color highlight isn't working for some reason. Yes. That's all I could find. thing is insanely tanky. Why? Okay. It's time to go. Should not mess around too much here. <laughs> Probably be wise of me to start the event now. Oh, okay. Hold on. This is kind of crazy. Um, go this. Okay, starting it. <laughs> Look at all the fireworks. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, it's another one of these star things. Okay. May as well. It just launches all these fireworks. Yeah, I don't think I even need to do that buff thing anymore. Let's 
have a look. Um. I got crit. Dude, ah, oh, stupid beetle. <laughs> I couldn't see it. Oh, that's kind of legit. It counts the, um... Ooh, like, those chests gives you three results. It walked in the way. about something. Okay, never mind. I'll still try to get up, but... I haven't actually explored the stages environment, really. They usually hide stuff, but... Maybe not in this stage. Can I get to that? Probably not, right? Yeah, no. Okay. Uh, I think we are good. Green portal. I have seven. <laughs> seven dolls. Alright, well... Rematch. So much easier when you're this strong. Oh, another one. Move. <laughs> I'll just use this to get the health. I mean, I am gonna explore the stage this time because I have the power to do so. There's actually something over there. That's it, right? Yeah. Up we go. What have we got? We can do more fuel cells. Or we'll trade it for one. I think the more fuel cell play is the better play. Oh, but this changes. No, this is white items. Never mind. It's not the play. one of these. 
It's gonna be going off like crazy. As stacked as I am, the fact that he disables my skills is is the problem. All right, here we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, Will. Calm down. What now? Touch. Let's see if there's anything else to do first. It would appear not. All right. Touch the thing. Offer item. Offer an item to be reborn. What does that mean? Um... That's what I think it means. Oh, there was a green portal there. Um, gifted with rebirth. Okay. That's cool. Oh, I got both characters now. All right, so that's the false sun and she if. Okay, sweet. Again, they didn't bother doing, with the exception of special. Oh. Manifest rotating orbs dealing 100% damage per second. And gaining temporary barrier when passing through enemies. Okay. Finally. Oh, cleavers have like a count. That's interesting. Okay. Oil. Zip zoom. Cool so far. I don't think bleed would be good here because you kind of run out of ammo. Quiet. 
<laughs> okay, the oil's pretty good. I'm not sure how I feel about the cleavers kind of feeling like the artificer. So you're just running out of ammo. I'm gonna, it looks like I'm gonna get bleed anyway. All right, good starting items. I was like, where's that other chest? Okay, that's cool. <laughs> okay, this burn attack is good. Does a lot of damage. Outside of the cleaver having like a cooldown, that's fun. Just means I have to be more accurate with it. This combo is awesome. moves very slowly though, so movement speed items are probably a priority. Like, he feels like how multi does.
Oh, look who got a shell now. I know it doesn't matter. It's cool. Alright. Down we go. Ooh, it's been a while. I have to do this the old, the old way. <laughs> Since, uh, this character doesn't really have movements. How was it? It was like here. And then here. And then here. It's okay, there's no... There's no death. No monsoon here. Curious to see how well it does here. funny with the uh sunglasses I think the problem here is going to be his movement not his survivability Um, I'm gonna get this just as a way to heal. Alright, where is it? 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 I don't see it. This is a problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. Go. Yeah, this is as bad as multi and captain. <laughs> just so slow. Ah, uh, come on. This is why I got slug. Okay, whilst it regens my health, I'm getting a drink out of the fridge. I'll be back before the health regens. If I didn't get the slug, this would have been very, um, unbearable. <laughs> Just sitting around waiting for health regen. Ay, ay, ay. Alright. Uh, that... Hmm. I mean, right now it's fine, but... That could potentially be concerning. Well done. Oh, right, the passive. He has a passive that, yeah, if you kill something with the fire, it becomes food. That's cool. I love that it implies he's a pizza chef. Um, mm, I wonder how. I mean, I guess it would count for void damage. It would slow down the rate it ticks out.
<sighs> Sorry. <laughs> this is a little, a little on the boring side. All right, there we go. For once, I'm not getting big enemies. I don't think they'll make it up the hill in time. Oh, I'm wrong. Good news is I can get rid of anything I don't want and make it scrap. Be good. I'm curious how that's going to work on me. I think I just saw it. <laughs> it did knock me up a little. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, his passive is very, very useful. It's a free monster tooth. Start over there. Oh, just <laughs> oh my god! The knock up is real. Just noticed I have the band and it doesn't seem to be proccing. This possible chef doesn't actually have a skill that works with it. 
I think this is the only skill that would trigger it. Uh-oh. That's not good. Now they're definitely going to get to me. Pretty realistic. Um, I'm gonna go with this. Like, fine. I'll go with this. Ha ha. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, I guess I gotta hang out here now. Everything is under control. Um, mm, go with us. I don't know how that's going to affect them. It could be a case of it does nothing, or it could be a case of, like, I'm going to get one shot. Oh no, for these, this is absolutely dangerous. It's either the clap or the laser is going to do a lot. i got to be careful. If I was to take a guess, probably the clap is the dangerous one. Ah! <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Um, this because he can proc it easily. Oh no. I have made a mistake. Uh oh. <laughs> no windows. <laughs> I don't want to turn on sticky keys. 
crap. <laughs> I need to disable that. Because I reformatted. Do you want to turn on sticky keys? No. sit here for a minute. Just because the next item is going to be the red one. Let's just be safe. Good enough. Uh, no, that's not good. All right. Well, wish me luck. It's not impossible to win against this. Very annoying. <laughs> it is winnable. Just gotta play well. Stop! <laughs> Alright, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Under control. Um, yeah, I gotta go the ICBM. So I wonder what the rebirth thing actually meant, because I didn't see anything. Uh, let's go with this. I thought maybe it would give me that item at the start, but I didn't see it anyway. But then again, it's not like I looked. Desperately need movement speed. Oh, there you go. That's probably a good way to do it. There's a scrapper. I'll just get rid of some things and get movement speed. Oh, no, that's, that's even better. Because attack speed's not really going to do much for Chef since ammo is a thing. get rid of this because this is duplication of his ability. The slugs and the shield and then I should be a good
That probably goes well. All right. Give me moving speed. <laughs> Much better. Still slow, but... Okay, now this, this is much better. It feels normal now. this one. Ah, oh, that's not good. They're just going to be wisps here and nothing else. Ooh, okay, okay. There's a way to get the bands. I'm just going to step away from that. I suppose that's a good way to proc band now as well. Okay, um... Need to go find another big chest if possible. I don't think this counts, does it? Oh, I forgot to reboot the game. That's yeah, fine. I guess it it's a, has to be a purchase. Okay, cool. There we go. That's the one. I wasn't looking forward to this because I only have three shots and they're just going to surround me. Okay. Oh, cool. ATG. Nice. And I have ICBM. No, that's actually very useful. <laughs> Alright, I'm looking for the teleporter. Ooh, okay. Seem to have good luck today. The 
the game is welcoming me back. Wait, where is this teleporter? Ah! I didn't see it anywhere on that side. It's not here, is it? What? Where is it? This is nice. The knives are just automatically taking out. Hey, Colin, what's up? How's it going? Oh, there it is. Of course, it's there. I think I can just stand still. These knives will... Ah, uh, maybe not. Wait a minute. Is the meat item stored in this chest? Hang on. I think I see it. Oh yeah, it is too. <laughs> That's cool. You can see it in there. So happy that he's in the game. This was my favorite character in the original. You got to go to an Avril Levine concert last night. Exhausted. Definitely want to take the day off, but the kids won't let you sleep in, so no point. <laughs> Glad you had a good time, at least. Is your voice all uh, scratchy? That usually happens when you go to a concert. It's so trippy that, like, you know, I'll associate that name with a teenager or whatever, or, like, someone in their early 20s, but that's not the case anymore. It's just, like, some Gen Alpha is going to be like, oh, that's old people music. Don't you dare! Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Get in, get in the, get in the spot. Oh, nearly, come on. Come on. Come on! I hate this. <laughs> Dude, just get in. It won't move. Can I get the other one? Oh, maybe, maybe this is... Oh. Oh, that, that, that. This is so evil and brilliant. As if a robot can't push. Oh my god. I'm wasting so much time. Hear that? Oh, oh you can push the back. Oh, no. <laughs> neither of them will move. Oh my god. What have I done? It, it's not moving now. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Just... Okay. Okay. Okay! Ugh! 
Got it. <laughs> Jeez. Are you shitting me? <laughs> That's like, what, six? Six failures in a row? Oh my god. Ever living in Lincoln Park were the first cities you ever owned? You got them for Christmas when you were 12. What's a CD? <laughs> Someone's gonna ask that. Uh, my first city was, um, Gorillas. It's cool, it's like, you know, mix of hip-hop and then alternative stuff. And they had that interact. What? Hey! They had an interactive CD that you could put in your computer. I got your Walkman that year too, went through so many batteries. I always wanted a Walkman, but they were too expensive. Why is this so dark? So. I ended up getting this, um, I don't even know what, it, it was something from China, but it was at this Australian retailer that used to sell stereos for cars. Um, and a bunch of other stuff. But, you know, they sold portable city players for some reason. So I got this thing, and the anti-skip on that thing was insane, and it, it's something that cost me, like, I think $30. And it, it just beat people that had the Walkman, like, you know, the real Sony City player. Like, it was to the point where I could shake it furiously for a few seconds, and it just would not skip. Like, I think I, I ended up damaging a CD before it... It skipped. It was, it was that good. It's kind of like, if you remember, how expensive DVD players would only play official DVDs and nothing else, but then the cheap and dodgy ones would play absolutely everything. It's kind of the same thing as that. I don't know if I still have it, it's probably like in a box somewhere, but... Um... I was very happy with that thing. Your first DVD player was the PS2. Well, a lot of people's was. Ours was not. We did get a PS2 later, though. I ended up getting a PS2. Um, it was a cheap buy. So, I have one now. It was the only console that I didn't have, and... Now I have a way to play that weird game that I purchased at, um, a thrift store. I'll probably get around to that at some point. But it was pretty good steal, like it was a hundred bucks and then it had 14 games with it. Um, and... What, like, there's some pretty good ones in there, like, I got San Andreas with it. Um, one of the Crash Team Racing games, Twin Sanity. I got Final Fantasy X with it. There's a few, there's a few others, but those were, like, the big ones. Getting FF10 and San Andreas with it was, like, with the console made it worth it. Um, so the game is called Something Else in America. It's one of those games that had a different title. But funnily enough, it was made by the people that made the GameCube Warrior game. 
which kind of explains a lot. <laughs> Um, I'm trying to remember what it was called. I think it was called Stretch Panic in America. But it was called something else here. One left, where is it? My blind. Does anyone see an indicator? I hope that bug isn't back. When the DLC that introduced this first came out, you would get circumstances where, like, um. Oh no, there it is. Like, the final enemy just somehow wouldn't spawn or would be somewhere unreachable breakout in europe yeah that's what it, yeah that's what it's called um i won't spoil why it's weird but there's a particular moment in it that moment in it that just really like got me okay this is probably good on chef Getting more charges of, um... Of his, uh, grease attack. Maybe when Yakuza's done, because, you know... Got a bunch of little things here and there that will only... Be... Very short, you know, that they're not long games by any means. I think I'm at the end. I had to make some money like during my lunch break. I was like, all right, let me make the money that I need, so then it's less of a process what I need to do today. What's on the list of games to play next? So, I mean, the next major one is the Zelda game that comes out next month. So until then, I'll probably do, like, minor things. Um, but I want to check out... Um, a couple of Japanese games. It's, they're like sequels to that shoot 'em up I played. Like the cute, weird one. They had sequels that never released, so I got copies of them. But those, they're only like a couple of hours. Um, there's another game that left early access called Core Keeper. It's like this underground mining game. It's pretty chill. And you kind of build a base and do farm stuff on it. I'm almost tempted to do one of the PS2 games. There's so much coming out next month, I didn't realize it. That monkey game that everyone's kind of going crazy for, I kind of have an interest in it, but the problem is it's, it's pretty pricey. So I'm probably going to wait for that to go on sale.
It also didn't help that Nintendo, the Nintendo Direct last night just gave me a bunch of other little games to kind of be on the lookout for. The, the, will it go on sale? It's unknown, but you know, I'm, I'm not exactly in a rush to play it. There's other stuff that I kind of want to check out more than it. Um, I might play Gris, because that game... I've had multiple people recommend it. I do have it, but I've just never checked it out. And the people that are making that game are releasing a new game um, also next month. So it might be a good idea to play that game. And it's not long either. But it's one of those games that has like a really nice art style. I just want to do like a bunch of little games that don't take too long. Since this is probably one of the longer Yakuza games that I've played. As fun and insane as it is. Um, you know, before I do the next one, I will need a break from it. The story in this one has been very good. Probably one of the better stories in the series. Oh, if, ah, that doesn't matter. There's no big chest here. I forgot about that. I have the, uh, the star item. I mean, outside of that, I'm not... Yeah, there's like... Ah, uh, there's not enough time in... in the day to want to play everything I want to play. But having that handheld now and being able to kind of play games that I know that probably won't interest everyone, um, but I can still play them. It's definitely been nice to... Um, not have to sit at a desk and kind of play wherever I, I want. Particularly in bed, that's been nice. Only I didn't have to work. Ah. <laughs> uh. It's more relaxing. It is, yeah. But it's also good not to be in the mentality where I think I have to stream everything. Or like... I don't have to be conscious about like, oh, this might be something that not everyone enjoys. Apparently I missed one. Oh no, I don't have enough money. I see. Whoops, I probably did this too early. I think about the way things are going. And if, I, if one day I were to not do the streaming thing anymore, I don't think I'd buy a desktop PC. I think by the time that comes around, like, portable handhelds will be to the point where, like, you could easily play off one and be perfectly content. And the one I have is, yeah, it's kind of at that point already. It's, I, there's very little that I can't play on that thing. Like, 
it just handles it pretty well. Oh! Oh, I got one shot. But oh, what the hell? What, what? What? What about this? What happened to this splitting incoming damage? <sighs> I just got risk of rained. <laughs> All right. Um, chef's fun. I'll do. I'll try this character out, and then we can do something like a dragon. Oh, that looks weird. What's going on with the ready button? Oh, it looks like the underlying graphics are going through it. I thought for a sec my graphics card was doing something weird. Okay. That's fine. Don't trade the skills. Okay, it's a melee character. Wait, what's this? Oh. That's interesting. Did I fix my computer? Um, I haven't had any crashes or anything happen in the past few days. But, you know, I, I ran a lot of tests and they, nothing came of it. And then suddenly, like, everything's kind of back to normal, so I don't know. I'm keeping an eye on it, but... Yeah, I worry that I have to, like, send it back for something. This is a weird control scheme. Like, you've got a separate right-click skill, but then if you hold left-click, you get a different right-click skill. It's a little weird. I guess instead of giving this only this character, like, another button, I guess was out of the question. I don't think it would have been that bad. This is a completely unique survivor character. Okay, I mean, if you wind it up enough. Wait, already? I mean, I guess I could do it. Um, I don't have to go through the portal. I can get the reward from it. Oh, I see. It drains money. Okay, that's cool. It's got, like, a charge beam. This character is definitely going to take getting used to. probably gonna die. <laughs> this was greedy of me. Okay, I'm going to die. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Don't do that early on. Noted. This is how we learn.
I don't know what I can chalk up what happened to. Like whether Windows Update did something or... Like maybe the BIOS update I did just bricked Windows. <laughs> I don't know. Something happened, it didn't like it, and it caused me a lot of pain for like four days, so... I guess that's the advantage of consoles is like, unless your console is experiencing, you know, what happened with the Xbox once upon a time, generally speaking, they're fine and you don't have to like, deal with stuff like that. But you know, on the other hand, like, especially now with the handheld I have, just the Steam library is just too good. I think the thing that sucks the most about console is... Alright, so take this game for example. This update probably won't launch on console right away. I don't think it has. Um, usually they have to wait a few months. There's always a uh, disparity between when stuff releases on PC versus console. I mean, the initial release, they line it up to it releases at the same time, but then after the fact, um, they don't... Well, there are some devs that do that, but not everyone. Like, the Stardew Valley update, for example, hasn't released on um, consoles yet. And that's been, what, like four months now? I'm not really sure what I'm going to build on this character. I would assume it would... Uh, it doesn't have a burst attack. But I'm guessing attack speed's probably the best way to go. Yeah, leave it. Uh, two, and if nothing happens, just go. This reflect damage item is probably good on this character because it's it's tanky. Ooh. Okay, no. Syringe printer. No, this is gonna be good. I hope. Yeah, we're going attack speed right away. Pull him in. Yeah, this is already much better. Oh! <laughs> Don't you dare. Um, let's... Yeah, again. Stack. Alright, I'm gonna fight, and I'll gamble later. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> Perfect bomb. Oh, this fight is gonna be insufferable, isn't it? Hang on. I suppose I can do that, but... Of all the bosses to get... Okay, on ya! Ah, no.
Okay, okay, we're fine. Sort of. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this extra skill, like, coming from holding left click. It's a bit, a bit clunky. The brain has its uses, but early on, it's like, ah. Uh... Actually, I don't think it'll do much for this character. What would it do, even? I can't believe this game has been out as long as it has, and that's still... I mean, I haven't seen it happen, but I imagine it's still a problem where items can go off the edge. Okay. Another very slow-moving character. Trading all of us for attack speed. I'm gonna hope that maybe I can get it down to like not trading the movement speed, but we'll see. Ah. Uh... No, you know what? Screw it. All in. <laughs> okay, that's cool. That's better. <laughs> Get a little bleed in there. I think I have something. Uh, I don't know if does it. I guess there's that new blue item. I could try and find it again. Just for shits and giggles. Um, I'll do one reroll. It is not here. All right, leave it. I tried. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I like that. It negates full damage. Or resets the full. What's this guy's abilities? Um, melee swing, right click to throw range. A shift that damages and then a beam is the R that damages. But also you have this other attack where if you're holding melee, you can do an alternate right click, which is a little clunky, but I guess it just takes getting used to. Oh, good. <laughs> I 
Actually, that that works. I'm at a batting cage. Yeah, this is fine. Alright, we can just chill. If it wasn't for these syringes, I, I would not be doing this well. Um, crowbar's probably not good. This'll probably work well. Just anything that's on hit. I think is the way to build this character. At least it's tanky, so... That's nice. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything for me. Alright, well, I don't have recovery. That's gonna do nothing for him. I think. Ugh, I got the feeling this is going to give me like DOs or something. I mean, the recharge for the range attacks, they take a while. Um, let's go with this, just as a little bit of a safety net. Oh no. This is truly like nightmare <laughs> for a melee character. I won't be able to get them. Ooh. Okay. I mean, I can do that, but it doesn't, it's not going to get them. I'm not sure I can win this. <laughs> this. Uh, these are the worst things you can get as a melee character. I guess it depends where, um, where I'm going. If there's good enough cover, then it'll be okay. Oh, maybe I should try the death beam. Hang on. Um, more attack speed! I don't see it. Okay, bolts are. I mean, this is nice, but that, again, just the enemies, not great for melee. <laughs> Dude. Can I try and do that at least? Okay, that sort of works. Okay, good. Kinda. Okay, okay, okay. Might not be so dire. Go. 
I, I, I have to, right? Oh, is that high ground? Uh, okay. Can you go up? Oh, you can. Okay, so it's not... Um, it's not in a straight line. Like, you can aim it. Okay, that's good. Alright, I'm gonna sit here for... Oh! Right, I have medkit. That's fine. I was gonna sit there, but I just do this, and I'm good. Oh. <laughs> this is just horrible for melee, and look, look what awaits me. It's like another syringe printer. It's almost like the game knows what class I'm playing as, and it's just sending the worst possible thing for me. Uh, at least the character has a ranged attack. I can't complain too much. Yeah, these ranged attacks don't do much. I hate this. <laughs> Man, if it wasn't for these, the med kit I just got, things would be very dire. Um, this one. More attack speed. Oh, no. Alright, this might be GG. If a, if a single ATG procs, I'm, I'm gone. So tense. Please, please do not proc. Okay. Um... Let's go with this one. <laughs> look at, look at this. Look at this enemy lineup. It's just like, oh, you're playing as a melee character? It'd be a real shame if the enemies that we give you are things that you can't reach. Or things that chip away at you from a distance. At least they're not heavy hitters. I just gotta hope that they don't hit me with an ATG. As long as that doesn't happen, I'll be okay, but... It's scary, man. Oh, okay. I need it. <laughs> so annoying. Okay, I'm still alive. Um, yeah, leech seed. The other, the star thing would have been better, but at this point, I have to go for like what's gonna keep me alive. And if I can get some heals off my melee swings, then. I will take that. Okay, that's gonna be useful. I'm gonna wait for the cooldown. Give me a second charge of that. I kinda have no choice. Sorry about this. <laughs> 
is kind of a critical that I can group them up. That's weird, I can't... There we go. That's what this character looks like. Okay, we're good. Oh no, they got shurikens. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm, I'm screwed. This is, this is, has to be one of the wor- One of the worst- One of the worst rounds of this I've ever gotten. You know, for that one good run the game gave me, it did this to me. Alright. <laughs> I tried both Chef and False Sun. Um, Alright, it's been five hours of this, so I think that's a good stopping point for Risk of Rain 2 for tonight. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. I, out of the three new characters, um, I think I need more time with this one to kind of make judgment on it, but this one's a lot of fun. Chef take some getting used to but it, it is fun um but i kind of enjoyed this this one the most so far so but maybe that'll change because you know i've only played each of these once but um i think the thing is just the cleaver being on a cooldown i think that's the thing that bothers me the most um but otherwise everything else is fine so all right, we'll do more of this soon. Uh, but if you're checking this out later as a replay on the VODs channel, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and if you want to support the channel, just click the like button. Helps a lot. So, yeah, thanks for watching.